Today, sadly, we are leaving this beautiful island of Cochang that we have called home for the past few days, which we have loved. It has been absolute paradise. But today we are heading to the second island in this little archipelago. I've always wanted to use that word, but I don't really know how to pronounce it. <laughs> Anyway, this second island is called Komok, and there are two ways to get there. The first way to get there is by a speedboat, and it's pretty quick, I'm not very scenic, I think it takes like an hour to get there, and it is 600 baht a person. The second way to get there is by the scenic slow boat, which I think only takes two hours anyway, and we love being on boats. Also, it was only 400 baht a person, so cheaper, slower so you don't get jostled around, and more scenic we took the wooden slow boat we just went and had a quick breakfast and we are waiting on our taxi to come pick us up also included in the price of the 400 baht a person so we're great <laughs> are you sad to be leaving this place yeah but i'm ready for the next adventure so oh i'm so sad to be leaving our beautiful this little... place is beautiful it's been one of the nicest places we've ever stayed thank you watercolor but then move on Thank you for everything. Thank you. Just got picked up in our truck taxi. We'll probably go pick up some other people before we head to the pier. So you thought you got it made for. He's a living, slipping out the back door. But it's not what you made for. And there's nothing that is too late for. This is like the longest pier ever. Check out this beach. So our bungalow where we're going to is super cute. It's called Thai, Idaho. So the guys from Idaho, and he married a Thai woman, and they named their bungalow Thai, Idaho. How cute is that? Thank you. Thank you very much. Enjoy. Thank you. Have a good day. Hey, you too. Wow, look at that view. Hi. Hello. Hi. <laughs> I got an equal thing those are. How amazing is our new place. I cannot wait to show you guys around. We just checked in. We had a little welcome coffee. It was so good. So I haven't had coffee in so long and this one had condensed milk, regular milk, and Thai coffee. Such a treat. Let's show you. Now I'm like hyped up on coffee. This is our room for the next five nights. We have a big king size bed that looks very comfortable and it overlooks this amazing view. I mean, it is so incredible. I'm really, really gonna like it here. This is what I'm not supposed to have coffee. <laughs> our view is so high, my ears are coughing. 
But the best, the best altitude is you go up as altitude, lower the lab. We have the highest altitude on the island, so my ears are popping. We have the absolute best view from our bed. I mean, I don't think it actually gets any better than this. So excited. We just made it down to the beach. It's so much different than Koh Chang. There is nobody around, which is so nice. We love this. It is so beautiful. On the other side, it was very windy, but here, the island kind of just stops the wind. It is super clear, smooth water. Let's go find a spot on this beautiful, secluded beach. Woo. what was supposed to be the most popular island on, I mean, most popular beach on the island. And there was maybe two people walking on the entire beach. It was completely deserted. So, so good, so private. I mean, if this is any indication on how our time on Comac is gonna be, it is basically paradise. For the rest of the evening, we're probably gonna go find a restaurant to have dinner, go see a sunset somewhere, but we cannot wait to explore this island over the next couple of days and show you guys all the best beaches, the things to do, rent scooters, everything. So, so excited to be here. Yeah, and that's pretty much everything. We got back from the beach and we got all showered up and nice and clean. And then we put on a fresh round of teeth. Because island life, right? <laughs> it's always great when you get out of the shower and put on that foot spray. Makes you feel real fresh. To some people, it's not a big deal. <laughs> Only to the DQs. All the drama queens out there, where you at? So we decided to keep it simple for tonight. We walked out of our accommodation right down the hill to a place called Ma'am's and that's what we're having for dinner. Yummy, delicious Thai food. Ma'am is making me up a fresh Thai style omelet with some steamed rice with some mixed vegetables pan fried. Delicioso. Mm -hmm. I got the pad thai with tofu and a banana shake. Iced tea, salud. We were walking down, there is somebody's house slash cocktail bar, and I think he's an artist. So I'm gonna talk Sammy into getting a cocktail after this to end our first day in Komak. Sundowner. That's Ooh. what they call him in Africa. <laughs> Sundowner, I like it. I so Sammy, do you think you outdid yourself? Yes, I'm starving. I got a Thai omelet. I got vegetables. I got rice. I got three separate dishes, and I'm gonna mix them all together, and it's gonna be the ultimate delicious. Got so much food. No way you're finishing that. Delicious pad thai. Sammy did work. It was delicious. Man, the cocktail place doesn't open until seven, and that's way past her bedtime. <laughs> but one quick thing to note: Dang it. that meal we just had was the cheapest meal we've had in the past 10 days, Kuching. We tried a bunch of restaurants there. It was much more expensive. There's been a lot more locals here than Kuching. I really like the mm -hmm. energy yeah, of it, the feeling. Yeah, it's... The vibe. That was under $10 for all three of her plates. <laughs> my Pad Thai and a milkshake and iced tea. It was delicious. And we will see you guys when we explore the island tomorrow. Yeah. Bye!